Hey, what's going on, you guys? This is Madeline. I'm coming back to you once again. This time we're going to go over the 97.5 KMOD. And the article is by Jason Hall. And it says an arrest warrant has been issued for Antonio Brown. Lord, what did he do this time? An arrest warrant has been issued for former All Pro wide receiver Antonio Brown in relation to a domestic dispute with the mother of his child. Fox 13 News Kevin O'Donnell reports have confirmed uh, have confirmation that a warrant has been issued for the arrest of antonio brown in tampa for multiple domestic issues on november 28th with the mother of his child o'donnell tweeted on thursday december 1st brown's facing serious legal issues court records obtained by fox 13 news confirmed that a risk a protection order was filed against Brown by the Tampa Bay by the Tampa Police Department on Tuesday, November the 29th. The suspect exited the residence and threw a shoe at the victim, striking her in the, the ponytail. The report via Fox 13 News: the victim had no injuries, but believed the shoe was meant for her head. The suspect would not open the door or come outside to speak with officers. The suspect also, during this incident, attempted to issue an informal eviction to the victim. A responding officer wrote that the victim's belongings were thrown in the street but had already been retrieved and placed in the, drop in the driveway when police arrived at the scene. The victim told the responding officers that Brown had two guns located inside the house at the time of the incident, according to the report. Brown reportedly locked himself inside the house as responding officers attempted to make contact with him at the scene. The suspect placed an informal eviction notice on the door, which would be up uploaded to this report with 11-28-2022 at the date showing the victim has seven days to gather her belongings and leave. The police report stated via Fox 13 News, the suspect continued throughout the incident to state that the victim had no right to be at the residence or to lead or to even gain entry to it because she did not live there. The victim's ID has the listed address as the residents of 10 as of 10 18 2022 officers advised the victim to uh, spend the night elsewhere after many failed attempts were made to uh, convince Brown to allow her to gather her possessions from the scene Brown once again regarded by many as a NFL best wide receiver has been at the center of numerous issues on and off the field in recent years. In April 2021, attorney David Hess announced that Brown's legal dispute with gymnast Brittany uh, Taylor dating back to 2019 has been settled in a joint settlement with a representative for Brown, uh, Alana Burst Burstyn. My apologies for the mispronunciation, if I did, obtained by NBC News. Taylor sued Brown, alleging uh, he essayed her three times while she was working at his personal as his personal trainer. The wide receiver uh, denied the allegations and later countersued Taylor, claiming her initial lawsuit stemmed from her his refusal to invest more than $1.5 million in her gymnastics business. In January, Brown was released by the Tampa Bay Buccaneers one day after a strange incident in which he stripped off his uniform and ran off the field during the team's game against the New York Jets at MetLife Stadium. Brown hasn't played for the NFL team since the incident and has instead served as excuse me, served he present of Kanye West's sports fashion line 
within his Donda Sports Creative Content Company, as well as continue to focus on his own musical career. Brown was selected by the Pittsburgh Steelers at number one, 196 overall in the sixth round of the 2010 NFL Draft and quickly emerged as a pinnacle pro bowl selection before demanding a trade amidst a contract dispute prior to 2019 season. The Miami native was later cut by Pittsburgh's trade uh, partner. The then Oakland Raiders prior to even appearing in a regular season game. Brown spent several games in 2019 with the New England Patriots and two seasons with the Buccaneers, with both tenures ending in controversy. The 33-year-old was a four-time first-team All-Pro 2014-2017, a second-team All-Pro in 2013, and a seven-time Pro Bowl selection in 2011, 2013, to 2018, having led all NFL players in receiving yards twice in 2014 2017, uh, receptions twice uh, in 2014 and 2015, and receiving touchdowns in 2018. All right, y'all, and this is what's going on now. Um, apparently he, I did do a story on Antonio Brown. Actually, I did a couple of stories on Antonio Brown. I just, I'll link it throughout the videos, throughout this video. So if y'all want to see it, y'all can, uh, go back. I think I did do a story about him and the alleged, uh, SA with his personal trainer at the time. Uh, apparently they have settled, uh, the dispute. Uh, so that's an update and uh he's moving right along to the next legal issue um like antonio brown cannot catch a break whether it's him bearing his arse in a, a swimming pool in dubai or you know doing something else of reckless yeah he i don't know what he's going for but he's definitely halfway there um I don't know what's going on with that man. But this is the latest in the Antonio Brown saga. Please drop down and meet me in the comment section so we can chop it up. Let me know your opinions on this. Uh, are you surprised? Do you care? Or uh, should he be uh, detained and sat down for a while, whether it be uh, jail time or whether it be a mental health facility? at this point you know let me know in the comments and thank you so much i do appreciate um the love and support that you show me on the videos uh thank you and don't forget to like subscribe and share and please remember that every video that i do it has the the, the overtones of allegedly so please take it with a grain of salt you guys you know <laughs> all right and with that, I will meet you guys in the next video.